Hi everyone, I'm Alona Nadler. I'm part of the product management team in Kibana, and I'm going to show you today how to create Pi, Donut, and uh, Tree Map. What's common for all of those are those are part of the whole visualizations. And I already created in the previous uh, video the table, so I'm going to just add another panel to my existing dashboard, and I'm going to choose lands here. And I'm looking at my uh, index that collects metrics. So what I'll do, I'll just drag the geo uh, country ISO code to the middle. And by default, it shows a bar chart, but I can see that I have a donut suggestions over here in the bottom, or I can actually click here and explicitly select it and it will transition to be um, a donut chart. Now, similarly, depends on the styling, you can use the pie chart. Now over here, what it does is it shows me the top uh, geo countries. And I can decide to see it right now, it shows the top five. I can decide to see the top 23, for example. Um, or if I want, I can say, I want to see the, I want to use the free form search query and say, I want to see countries, the US versus what's not US. So let's use this. So this will be like, I'll just call it US. And I'll add another one that says, let's say, um, country, US, and I'll add here not. Great. So this is another option how to choose that um, and to use the filter aggregations, which are very powerful. So this is outside of the US. And again, it's really easy to move between those. So I actually do want the top values of the country here. So again, I'm going back and I'm gonna show that based on, let's do five. Now, similarly, I can also decide to choose other fields and have other dimensions as slices. So inside the country, I also wanna see the city. And what it does, it shows me the top three cities for every country. And now it's based on the number of records. I can change that and say, I want that to be based on sum of bytes. Perfect. Now you can see that by default, you see the percentage here. And, but something else that you can do is say, I actually want to see the values, not the percentage. And those will show me the total number of bytes and I can format it over here to just show them better. So those are bytes, let's make it slightly easier. And now I can switch between either showing it between the percentage or in bytes. And last but not least, there are a few charts that kind of like goes into the category of part of the whole, tree map being one of them, as well a different representation. I personally really like the tree map representation, um, but you can pick and choose whatever fulfill and answer your um, questions. And now I can just save, I'll call it tree map and it will get me back to my dashboard and I can just add that in my dashboard. And like any other thing in Kibana, it's interactive. So I can say, let's say I'm, I wanna focus on Verona and now both the table and the tree map is focused only on the Verona, um, which is really interesting and really interactive. That was it for this chapter.